said, boy, can you make me stay? Jensen, Brooke, Jensen trying to save it. Count one up down the back. Two of the feature winners here on the front stretch as well. Travis Scherr. Oh, God, that was like at the bottom, brother. There's still three wide for the race lead. Game modifies the 48 of Bob Moore. The his outside the Billy Moyer victory race car, the 7 and of Jay Notaboom. Rolling off ninth in the 14, that's Matt Bonine. The his outside the 02 JR Chris Mills. Jeff Barron's in the 35. Thor Anderson in the 41. The 14F machine in the Lakefield, Minnesota. That's Jason Fisher. The 44X is Speed Schneiders. The 10N is John Kleins. But Sean Berrigan in the 88. Chris Paul's Rock in the 5. Shane DeMay, the 5N. The 20 of Chad Tenaple, the 17L, Nick Lakes. 21 of Jason Breeze, the M80, Jim Matheson, the 27, Daniel Loggins, the 7S of Bob Fleshman. Green flag, 20 laps, here we go. RJ Merchant goes to the top spot. Meanwhile, back in the pack, two and three wide. It's time to dance. It's Merchant, Sackett, Bulwer, Abelson, your top four. Off of turn four in lap one. Merchant Lakes, excuse me, Merchant Sackett, Bulware, Abelson, Moore, Bob Moore, catfishing on the bottom. He's making that bottom line work, moving to the front and getting there in a hurry. Moore challenging for fourth. Thor Anderson goes around in turn four. Caution for the 41 of Thor Anderson. Anderson coming to a stop in turn four, brings out the caution. Two laps scored complete, 18 laps remain here in the Artworks Graphics Modified Main Event. Into turns three and four, the Delaware double foul restart. RJ Merchant brings them back to green flag racing. Todd Bowler gets a good bite at the top of the speedway, but gets a little bit loose. Bowler and Sackett side by side for that runner up spot. Meanwhile, working the top side of the speedway, here comes Jay Nodum. Chris Abelson goes around. Chris Mills goes around. Daniel Loggins caught up. Jason Breeze caught up. Jim Matheson stopped in turn four. Nick Lakes off to the top to avoid as well as Chris Mills got looped around in front of the field. Todd Bulware, Bob Moore, now Jim T's your top five. Green flag waves, here we go. Todd Bulware dives to the bottom, trying to get the bite on the bottom of turn two. Bulware side by side with RJ Merchant into turn three. Can Bulware take the top spot? He goes slide job Jones up the track. Bob Moore slides up as well. New leader, Todd Bulware. Todd Bulware to the top spot. RJ Merchant second, Justin Sackett, Jay Notaboom, Jimmy Cole from your top five. As Bob Moore having some handling issues on the 48, can't seem to keep it held down. Big Bob a lot of Moore in the 48 as he continues to fall back in the pack. Jay Notaboom looks to the outside of Justin Sackett in a battle for that third spot. Notaboom picked up the win last week. Can he make it two in a row? Or can Todd Bulware get his first ever win in a modified? Notaboom with a big run off turn two. Move Notaboom up to P3. But Notaboom dives to the bottom. He's going to try to get it on Merchant two. Up to second, the seven hand of Jay Notaboom. The 14F goes around in turn two. Gets back on the gas. We'll stay clean and green. 
Todd Bulware leads, but he's got a shark charging from behind. Jay Notaboom is lurking, trying to find a way around the 14 of Bulware. The 14F of Jason Fisher goes a lap down. New leader down the back stretch. It's Jay Notaboom. Shane DeMay off the top of turn four. Shane DeMay stopped at the exit of turn number four. He's going to have a caution. Caution for the 15M. 15M stops in turn four. Tough break for Shane DeMay as he was trying to work his way to the front of the field. The lights are out to run a speedway. Notaboom, Bullware, Merchant, Sackett, Tease, Green Flag is out. Here we go. Todd Bullware took a look at the inside but couldn't make it work as Notaboom has got that top side getting the hammer down. Off turn four, it's Jay Notaboom. Todd Bulware, RJ Merchant, Jim Tees, Justin Sackett. With the track, uh, getting a lot of rain this afternoon, getting a couple spots that are getting a little bit rough, but the driver's doing a pretty good job of avoiding. As Notaboom continues to lead, battle for fourth heats up. Justin Sackett, Jim Tees battling for that fourth spot. But Jay Notaboom gotten perilously high in one and two that time. Notaboom still leads. Better line for Notaboom that time through one and two. Didn't get quite as high. Jim Tees with a slider on RJ Merchant can't make it stick. Yellow in turn four. Yellow. Yellow in turn four. Caution on the speedway for the 7S of Bob Fleshman. Fleshman comes to a stop in turn number four. So definitely check out that car in the pit area. Twelve laps scored complete. Eight laps remain. We go back green. Todd Bulware trying to make that bottom line work, but Notaboom too strong up top. It's Notaboom, Bulware, Merchant, Tease, and Sackett, your top five. Jeff Barron slows in three and four, but Barron's gets back on the gas, trying to get that 35 car going as Barron's will rejoin the field. Looks like the bottom line is becoming the preferred line around the speedway for everyone but Notaboom. Have to wonder if Jay will make the change. Jim Tease with a big run in the 23, trying to get around Justin Sackett for fourth. Todd Bulwer, big bobble in four, gets her sideways but straightens it back out. Another one out in the loose stuff, Matt Bonine gonna lose about five spots, taking it off the top of turn four. Justin Sackett having trouble in one and two, loses fourth to Bob Moore and fifth to Jim Tease. As Notaboom now almost a half straight away back to Todd Bulwer. Chris Mills goes around again in three and four. Mills on the infield in three and four, probably not far enough off track. But he gets it refired, pulls into the infield, will stay green. With Jay Notaboom out front and beginning to pull away. Jim Tease and Justin Sackett still battling for that fifth spot. As Bob Moore takes a look at the inside of RJ Merchant. Bob Moore got a right rear tire getting some wear from the corner panel. Have to see if that tire holds out through the closing laps. 
Thor Anderson takes a shortcut through the infield. He'll rejoin the field. As Bob Moore goes, slide job! Look out, Bob Moore trying to slide her contact with RJ Merchant. Merchant breaks something in the front end as well. finish as the lights go out. Notaboom, Bullware, Sackett, Tease, Cole, Green, White, Checkered finish. Here we go. Two laps shoot up for the aim odds. Todd Bullware dives to the bottom of the speedway. Has to check up. Couldn't get the grip. Notaboom holds on. Into turns three and four, coming to the white flag this time. Bullware still working the bottom. Notaboom pushing the cushion up top. Big bed sheet says we've got one to go. Matt Bonine goes around the top of three and four. Bonine comes to a stop in three and four. We'll have caution on the speedway. As the field had taken the yellow, the white flag, we will have caution and checkered together. The entirety of the field had taken the white flag. And the caution came out after the field had taken the white flag. So your winner will be the 7N. Two weeks in a row for Jay Notaboom. He'll pull back into victory lane here momentarily. So your f top five looks like this. Finishing fifth will be the 55 of Jimmy Cole. Fourth, the 17 of Justin Sackett. Jim Tees takes the third spot in the 23. Second with a great run in the A mod for the 14 of Todd Bulware. And your winner heading into victory lane. He's already there. Did see the twister. Enter Jay Notaboom t-shirts like she called her shot. He's got the hell off. He can hear you make some noise for your feature winner. Two weeks in a row for Jay Notaboom.